when not to use a NoSQL database. So the very first one right up here in the front is if you need ACID transactions. If you need a consistent database with ACID transactions, then NoSQL will not be able to serve this need. NoSQL databases are eventually consistent and do not provide ACID transactions. We'll talk about this much more in Lesson 3. If you need the ability to do joins, NoSQL does not allow the ability to do joins. This is not allowed as it will result in a full table scan. Scanning a whole table is highly frowned on as the data might be spread over hundreds or thousands of servers. Ability to do aggregations and analytics. For the same reasons just mentioned, aggregations and analytics are not meant for NoSQL databases without optimizations. A product like Datastax Enterprise adds support for this with a combination of Apache Cassandra and Apache Spark in their product, but it doesn't come right out of the box. Having changing business requirements. Ad hoc queries are possible with a NoSQL database, of course, but difficult as the data model was done to fit to a particular query. You will need to have your queries in advance with a NoSQL database to do proper data modeling. If they are not available or you need to be able to have flexibility on how you query your data, you'll need to stick with a relational database. If you have a small data set, NoSQL databases, again, were made for big data sets, not small data sets. And while it does work, it wasn't created for that. The overhead would be unnecessary, but you should always evaluate your own use case when making these decisions. As you can see, all the reasons to not use a NoSQL database are the reasons to use a relational database. Over time, NoSQL databases are improving and adding features, but there are some features that are just not available by design. NoSQL databases are eventually consistent, again, more on this in Lesson 3, and they do not have ACID transactions. The ability to do joins is not allowed as a full table scan are highly frowned on, as you may be joining tables across hundreds or thousands of servers. Remember, NoSQL databases and relational databases do not replace each other for all tasks. Both do different tasks extremely well and should be utilized for the use cases they fit best.